Well, hello everyone. I'm meteorologist Adam Clayton here in the Storm Team 27 Weather Center, bringing you an update uh, for your weather on this Super Bowl Sunday. Now, temperatures did start off cold this morning. They were in the low to mid 20s, but now they are responding to that sunshine. It's 28 here in Youngstown. This is shortly after 9 a.m. By the way, 27 here in Minerva, 29 in Wellsville, and even some 30 degree temperature values starting to show up. And most of the cloud cover staying off to the south and east. There were a few high clouds out there right now, but nothing that's causing any major issues. Actually, a storm system down here in the southeastern United States is bringing a little bit of snow to parts of southern Tennessee and northern Alabama, sort of where I grew up. So seeing some snow down there, but no snow up here. The storm system is going to continue to meander and push off to the south and east. We're not worried about it at all today. And in fact, the future tracker here shows that temperatures will warm up to nearly 50 degrees today with a good bit of sunshine, and that will be great to see. Then later on tonight, clouds will break up for time, but I think there will be moments of high clouds passing through the area. Low temperatures tonight in the mid to upper 20s and then tomorrow. Once again, watch these clouds clear out and by around 3 or 4 p.m. temperatures right back to 50 degrees for your Monday with lots of sunshine once again. And I'm telling you this warm weather is going to continue as we head into the work week, but the weekend forecast here Super Bowl Sunday, of course, near 50 today, mostly sunny, mostly clear tonight, low of 29 and mostly sunny tomorrow with a high near 50 degrees. Now watching this upcoming weather pattern. There will be a weak storm system that tries to bring in some rain showers into the area late Tuesday night into uh, early Wednesday morning. But the big story here is there's going to be a stronger storm system develop out here in the southwestern United States, and that's going to promote strong southerly flow into the valley on Wednesday when we could see the potential for a record high temperature and maybe even in the day on Thursday. But there's going to be rain that comes into the area on Thursday that might hamper those chances for a record high temperature. And then a cold front pushes through Thursday night, which will bring some cooler temperatures as we head into the day on Friday. So looking at this Wednesday's forecast, now, the average high temperature for this time of year is around 37 degrees. The forecast high on Wednesday, 65, so nearly 30 degrees above average. That would tie the record high set back in 1954. And then Thursday's forecast high of 62 would get close to that record high set in 1990. So the seven-day forecast here shows that those 50s are going to even stay for Valentine's Day. Mostly sunny with a high of 52 on Tuesday. Wednesday, a high of 65 degrees with partly cloudy skies. That's the day where we could break that record high. And then the rain coming in here on Thursday with that cold front. Now on Friday, the high temperature will probably start out around 50 degrees near midnight. Then it will drop throughout the day into the 30s. Could be the stray chance of some rain or snow showers, but uh, no little to no accumulation likely right now for Friday. And then some colder weather showing up for Saturday. Well, I hope everyone has a great Super Bowl Sunday. I hope everyone has a great Valentine's Day. I'm meteorologist Adam Clayton here in the Storm Team 27 Weather Center.